Howdy folks, it's Mama B here, and today we're going to talk about sore throat remedies. Now it's getting into the winter time, and the colds are coming, and the sore throats that come along with them. So I'm going to show you a guaranteed way of getting those colds gone. So start with your favorite drink, and you want to make sure it's not too hot. For the record, this is too hot, but we'll fix that. All right, I'm also going to ask my wonderful assistant, Jojo. Hello. From Jojo Fun Stuff to help out. She's going to be the hands. All right, so Jojo, your favorite drink is hot chocolate? Yeah. And so we're going to let you mix this up. Jojo's really good at making hot chocolate. Ooh. So she's just going to make this, make up her favorite drink. I make this like. And you'll want it to be your favorite warm drink because it will help. Do I just add it in? The, yep, mix it up. Should, should I use the straw? Yep. Yeah. And she likes hot cocoa with baby marshmallows in it. Who doesn't? Now, the nice thing about this is this will get your kid, this will help your kids when they don't want to take any medicine and their throat hurts. Just mix it up. I eat that medicine. Yeah, but you like this, don't you? I do. Does it work for you, Jojo? When yeah. you have a sore throat? Mm-hmm. See, it works. And I, when I was a kid, I used to just take cayenne pepper on the tip of a spoon with a tall glass of milk and dump that powder straight in the back of my throat. And by the time I chugged down that that milk, it was the sore throat was gone. But I'll tell you what, that's the hard way to do it because. Sometimes I, I inhale. Woo, you do not want to inhale cayenne pepper. Okay, so now we're going to take the cayenne pepper, and you just sprinkle a little bit on. If you have a high tolerance for heat, then you can sprinkle more, or if you don't have a lot, sprinkle less. And if your mom making it, just sprinkle what you think is right, and you can taste it before you give it to your kids. Now, the straw is very effective for getting it past your tongue, to the throat where you need it. Now see that's not very much. Mm -hmm. That's the right amount for starters. And then you just stir that up. And then we didn't fill it very full so we can add more water to it to cool it off or an ice cube and it's going to be fantastic. Okay so by the time that your little one or you if it's mama, it works for mamas too and dads. But by the time that drink is gone, that little cup, it's just a basic teacup. By the time that cup is gone, your sore throat will be much better. If your th sore throat is not gone completely, just do it again. Give it a couple of hours, you know, in between so you don't just fill up on hot chocolate. But this drink will help your sore throat to go away completely. And you'll want to know another little secret. Even if you don't have a sore throat, it's kind of nice. A little bit of cayenne pepper in your hot chocolate. So I hope this helps. This cayenne pepper has worked for me for years. From the time I was a little kid, I still do it now. It's the only thing that really gets rid of sore throats. And there's no side effects unless you inhale cayenne pepper. That's not good. But it's a very effective way to get rid of your sore throat. It's soothing, it's warm, it helps your throat feel better, and it heals your sore throat. Has it helped you, Jojo? Yes. Yeah. Very much. Do you like it? Yeah. It's kind of sore to, it's kind of hard to swallow when you have a sore throat, isn't it? Mm-hmm. But it's nice when it has chocolate milk to go with it, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, hot chocolate. All right, so this is the remedy, and it's... It works for me every single time. So we hope this helps you. And most of all, we hope you stay well this season and through the cold. Um, thanks for watching our videos. Please share them with your friends. And have a fantastic day. Bye. Bye.